Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Toria Bonita. Okay, anyways. Um, this is a dry skin battle video. I told you this was coming because my skin is super dry. Yes, it is. So today we are comparing the Honey Do Me Up by NYX against the Farsali Gold Elixir. Yes. This one retails for, I think, $13.99 or $11.99. I got this at Target. This one retails for $22.00. And this is from Sephora. They have a bigger one for like $64, but yeah. So today we're gonna start this video by doing half our face one, half our face the other, and then um, I'm gonna do a full face of makeup over it so we can see which one kind of reacts to the makeup better. I have confession to do. I already filmed, when well, I didn't already film, I already did my makeup with half and half, but I forgot to push the record button. So I just took it off. I washed my face. I did put my sunscreen on. Okay, um, the foundation I have is my handy dandy urban dream cover I love how dewy this is it just makes my skin look kind of like quenched you know what I mean um, this is a different color so if you watch the Maybelline full face video from uh, the last makeup Monday video then you saw I did like a 128 and 130 mix this is a 120 so this is lighter a little bit brighter because let's face it I'm light uh -huh. We do have another backdrop as well. I'm in my dining area right now. So like I said, if you wanna see a house tour, then go ahead and drop that in the comments below. Also, while you're there, go ahead and hit like and subscribe. I already put a little something on my eyes, just a little, a little bit of, um, this is the Tarte Make Believe in Yourself palette right here. What I used was this one right here. This is the color Myth, and then I went in with Mystic with my finger and just kind of rubbed it on my eye. And then I did a little bit of my go-to gel eyeliner that I've been using, trying to get used to the gel eyeliner, because I kind of do like the control that I have with it, but yeah. This is the Maybelline Eye Studio. Let's jump in. I'm gonna do this a little differently. I'm not gonna talk through the makeup application. I'm just gonna jump in, do my makeup, and then we'll catch up at the end. I'm gonna wear this for a little while because I did have to go to work today, so it's already like half the day done. It is 3.33, so I'm gonna wear it probably for a good like five to seven hours, all right? And then we'll see how it looks at the end of the day. But let's jump in. Everything will be linked down below, as you already know, all right.
All right, guys, so this is the completed look. I know I need a lippy. I'm gonna spray myself in the bathroom because my cat eats right here and I'm not trying to spray her food. No, no, no. But uh, this is the completed look. So um, I'm gonna be trying this out. Let's see what time it is now. 3.59. So let's say four o'clock. I'm gonna try to keep it on for about six hours up until 10 o'clock and then I will let you guys know how it looks. So these earrings are from Walmart. Walmart has some good like light statement boho type earrings. At least they did. I don't know what they have this season. These are from last year. But yeah. But let's go take a look at this look in the baño. All right, guys, here we are in the bathroom. I gotta put on my spectacles. So, I mean, you could see my texture, but again, I have really dry skin. I did not set right here or anything. I'm just leave it. I leave it how it is. If it comes off, it comes off. As far as these two, I kinda like this side better. I feel like it, blended a little better and I feel like this side looks a little lighter you know what I mean this is the honeydew side and this is the farsali side but yeah I will catch y'all in a few hours all right guys I lied I'm back real quickly because I forgot to spray my face I'm gonna be using the MAC prep and prime fix plus spray this is that tropical one that came out because you know Real bonita is tropical. All right, guys, it is 10 11, and this makeup has now been on for six hours. Testing out half and half. Let's take a look. So there's some here. It looks like red, like my redness all came out on this side. On this side, a little bit here, but that's okay, but not as much here. And this side looks drier, no? Uh, the forehead. The forehead is decent still. I was eating, so, you know, I went to a baseball game. <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, this, I think this side with makeup is my... This side feels a little bit more tacky. Actually, I feel the same right now. So I think I might have a dupe product for my Frisali Gold Elixir. And it's the NYX Honeydew. So we're going to find out how it feels on its own without makeup all day tomorrow. See you guys then. Bye -bye. Uh, I mean, no, bye -bye. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Okay guys, it is now the next day. I have taken a shower, washed my face. I did my eyebrows because we're going to the fair and you know your girl needs eyebrows for like the fair. For work or staying home, I don't need eyebrows. But I don't even know what they look like to be honest. They look ochre. All right, anyways. So I did um, sunscreen. I used this Cetaphil Daily Facial Moisturizer with sunscreen SPF 50. Um, it's for all skin types as you can see. I have been using this for a few like months now on the daily and as you can see it kind of plumps up my skin and makes it a little bit more radiant which I like and the reason I, I wasn't going to put this on to do this challenge if I was just staying home and cleaning and doing laundry but since we're going out and we're going to be outside I definitely need sunscreen because not only my light skin and pink skin I'm also highly sensitive scared me my cat highly sensitive to the um sun as everybody is so yes okay <clears throat> so here we go we have our two here yeah I'm just gonna hit right here I'm gonna leave all the center areas oh like 
without any product. And I'm going to get a sponge and I'm just going to put it, I'm going to combine both on the sponge. I'm going to put them down the center because if that really helps this whole center part of my face not be so dry. That is what I'm here for. go get the sponge and I'll be right back okay and I'm back so I picked up um, a mini concealer sponge from real techniques now I'm just gonna take a little bit of the farsali and put a little bit should I start with this I think I'll start with this one because this one's kind of like a spatula and the other one's a dropper okay. I'm just gonna put some on here like that Take a little bit of this, put a few drops on there. I'm going to mix it up with my finger a little. And then I'm going to definitely hit the center of my forehead here to hopefully help with the dryness. feels so good right here though all right so as you can see how this is like really dewy down the center here because I used a combo of them both what I'm hoping is that so my goal in this video is to be able to get this instead of this because your girl's on a budget lately and this was $8.99 as of today on the Target app and this is still $22 the big one is $54 but you know if there's a combo of them both and it'll save me money because I'll be able to save on this by not using as much I will do it I will do it let's get these corners over here but this is it. This is the final. Um, I put these on. I'm not putting anything else on my face. No sprays. No makeup besides eyebrows. And I will be back with you guys after the fair to let you guys know exactly how they feel after hours and hours of wearing them. Let me put on my spectacles so I could see what time it is. It is 2.23 p.m. So when I come back in a few hours, I will let you guys know, okay? I had a tickle in my throat. Okay, so it is now 8.40 p.m. When I looked at the clock earlier, it was 2.23, and I, since then I have gone to the fair. Um, if you wanna see some cool, like, tasting vlogs, you can head on over to um, my other channel called Part of My Pancakes, and that's where I'm going to. I already have some tasting vlogs over there, but I'm gonna put a couple more. My favorite thing to do is county fairs. Besides that, so it's now 8:40. I've had this on my face for about six hours, six plus hours, and um, looking at it, so I think this. I, if I remember correctly, this is the side that we put the honeydew on and the feel of it feels pretty soft. It feels a little dry right here, like right in this area here, right here. And then this side, this feels not as dry on this side. This is the Farsali side, but everywhere else, feels just about the same so I don't know if this one needs a little bit extra maybe over here I don't know but everywhere else feels about the same let's see the area down the center because remember I put a combo of both feels super moist so I kind of like the combo of them both yeah my nose feels so like still like dewy and tacky still you know which is pretty dang cool. Hi. I would have to say that the Honeydew by NYX, for me, for my skin type, is a definite dupe for the Farsali, which will definitely save me about, well right now it says $8.99, but I saw it for like $12, I think I got this for $12. This was $22, so at least it'll at least save me $10. And look how much you get more in this one. You get, 
0.776 fluid ounces and then this one you get 0.34 so you almost get double the fluid ounces for half the price so it's definitely a dupe for my skin type if anyone else has done this um, combo or has done the comparison let me know down below if you have any other suggestions for uh, a dupe for this one or even a comparison for this one let me know I'm willing to try because my skin is so dry right now it feels pretty good though but we were out in the sun all day so that's why I'm a little red even though I have suntan my skin as soon as it gets flushed or heated it turns red so yeah all right, but that's the end of this video. I love you guys so, so much. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe so we can keep the familia growing. Also, if you have any suggestions for my dry skin battles, let me know down below. I am pretty much willing to try because my skin needs help, especially with winter coming. I'm scared. And my hands. I have really dry hands right now too, so help your girl out. You know what I mean? But anyways, I will see you guys in Friday's video. I love you guys so, so much. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe because I have so much planned for this channel now. Like, I have my inspiration back and I'm so happy. And I will see you guys then. Bye-bye, guys.